a request queue up. There we go. And now back to the stream to check the audio. Still got my Minecraft. Check the audio. Yeah, that sounds good. I've still got my Minecraft game open. Hang on, I will just quit out of that. A request queue up. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's the YouTube stream. Cool. Nice. Oh. Yeah, sorry. I left my thing open. I left it running. Oh, doing the last minute stream prep. I've got back into uh, Overgrown today. When I discovered... Uh, well... I stopped playing a couple of days ago because... I hit a bit of a wall in the tech tree. You need um, lots, and I mean lots, of um, ink sacks. But because they had loads of new kinds of fish, it's virtually impossible to... Uh, um, to find squid. So I have I ended up just cheating in a stack of ink sacks in order to actually progress with the game. Right. Vulcanoids. Hey, right, so, uh, wow. Okay, I've had two requests for singing. <laughs> um, Pelican Town. Did what what description did I not change? Oh, the Twitch one. I forgot to change the Twitch description. I keep forgetting to do that. Cause that's everything else I do from um uh from the restream hub, but the Twitch one is the only one I can't and I always forget about it. Which is why it keeps posting about Pelican Town. When I, no matter what game I, I stream, I'll try and remember for the future. Right. So, hello, Billy, GT, Flaffy, Cookie, uh, Sam, Derpy, Fire Dragon, Max, and I think Colinium, and I think I saw someone else as well. Luca, that was it. Cool. Yeah, it was from a while ago with the Stardew stuff. I'm not sure I actually have audio on this. I may have turned it off. Yes, I turned it way down. Okay. Is it registering the game? It did. A, there it is. Cool. Hello and welcome to Garen Reaver vs. Vulcanoids Live Part 1. I played a fair bit of this after doing the first impressions. I played about 7 hours. I've got about 8 hours total. I usually do about an hour for the first impression, so I assume I played about 7 hours more. That was a while ago. It's had quite a few updates since then. Hey, Alec. Hey, Shira. So, um,. I'm looking forward to, to seeing what, what was added. I sort of stopped because it was getting a little bit grindy and other stuff was distracting and it, there wasn't like one particular big thing that made me stop playing this. Hey Violet. So, uh, just before we get started, and I will start the gameplay just in a minute, uh, it's somebody's birthday today. Uh, GT Walker, who is... Um, one of my longest term patrons, but also a moderator of the Discord uh, and and a, a good friend. It is his birthday today, he's in the chat right now, so everyone wish him a happy birthday. And two people have redeemed a sing something in order for me to sing happy birthday. So I'll redeem Cookie's one and I'll uh, I'll sing another thing later on. But if you'll all uh, join me in, in singing... Uh, 
Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to GT. Happy birthday to you. So happy birthday, GT. Hope it's a good day. Sorry about the lockdown and everything. So, let's start a new game of Volcanoids. You can. Oh yes, they had a custom. But I will just go with normal. I think that's the one I played on. Used to be a place. Rich, it's quite quiet. Sorry. So I did uh, first impressions of this a while ago. Essentially it's a base building game where your base is a giant drill. I'm kind of looking forward to this. It's a bit more active than some of the other stuff. It does have its fair bit of sort of... Um, uh, grindy bits and processing and stuff, but it also has shooter sections, so that should be fun. Okay. Is Fire Dragon still here? Ugh. So yes, this this is a, a fun game. It, uh, it's about fighting robots and improving your drills so you can get to the, the deeper parts, work out like what's happening. I got far enough to sort of get hints at the... Um, so the whole thing that was going on, but I won't spoil what I found out. Ah, hey Fire Dragon. Are you involved with the game? Because you, you mentioned that you're the moderator of the um, Vulcanoids Discord. Are you sort of more specifically involved with the game? Okay, so I have a wrench, a pickaxe, a revolver, and a healing kit. I cannot remember any of the commands, so I'm just going to have to go through the uh, the tutorial and we'll see. I will turn up the volume a tad. Hopefully that's not too loud. Hello! Good day, sailor. Before we can continue with the expedition, you have to construct a device. Follow the given objectives and you will soon be piloting your own drill ship. That's a bit too loud now. Hey, Pi. Kind I'm a moderator on their Discord, not a dev at all. Okay. Uh, get a drill ship core into your inventory. So I need... Oh, I need to go, uh, go ashore. Ah. I've got 14 minutes till the next eruption. I, that'll be familiar if you saw the first impressions, but if you didn't, that's perfectly fine too. I'll be going through all of this from the beginning. Uh, oh, I need to go get some more over here. Yes, Pi, it's uh, GT's birthday today. 
Uh, Fire Dragon says, I suggest stuff and give feedback. I get to test early versions of upcoming updates, so yeah, I'm somewhat participating in the game. Okay. I always get a bit nervous when it's like a dev is, is directly aware of what I'm saying. I've had a few times when I've complained about a game and then the dev's been like, okay, I understand your feedback and I'm like, oh, I feel like a horrible person. Okay. Uh, place items in the storage. Right, all of those. Oh, and the coal. That too. Go to the storage module. Open the module. Deploy the power station. So the way this works, you see, is you've got your drill sort of unit, and then you have these modules that at, by default are sort of up, which means they're sort of defended, but it means you also can't use them. So you have to deploy them, which on the drill sort of flops them out. Uh, produce. I need two copper ingots. And production over there. This will all come back to me. I did play a reasonable reasonable amount of this, so I should be able to get back into it reasonably quickly. Component module. Here we are. Nope. Core. 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 Drill ship core one. I'm just trying to fly through the tutorial so that we can get to the sort of the actual game. I will take that back out because that was mine. We have received a distress call of a heavily damaged drill ship that will soon surface close to our location. Use this to your advantage and claim the drill ship. You got it. Off we go to shoot some bad guys. I say bad guys. People just trying to survive. They're robots, I think. No, this is... I thought it would be more Minecrafty, but it's, it is more of a base-building game than, uh, than Minecraft is, for example. I mean, Minecraft does have base building elements, but it's it's just as much about other stuff. But no, this is very much the base is sort of the core of everything you do. And that is... Ah! Oof. I also found the combat a bit plain, but that was a... Oh. That was a while ago. Uh, they might have updated it. I don't know. It has been quite some time since I last played. What happened to my gun? Where did I put my gun? I... Yeah, I put everything in his inventory for some reason. So, this is now mine. Assuming there's nobody in here who needs murdering. Anybody le left need murdering? Nope, seems all murdered out. Fantastic. Okay. I claim this drill ship in the name of me. Repair drill ship. The drill ship is heavily damaged. It must be. It must have been hit by a volcanic eruption. It's still capable of travelling, but the hull is in very bad condition. Fix all the destroyed walls and place door frame. A door frame. Or the door frame. So while you're surfaced, you're sort of vulnerable to attackers, like those guys. Uh, but it also means you have these modules. So, for example, if I click that, the module folds back up, you see. It's also quite heavily damaged, as you can see. So these uh, have sort of better defense than when they're down. When they're down, they can destroy the module much more easily. So you have to balance various things yeah I look forward to a, a full combat rework uh, particularly as some parts of this game can be quite combat heavy if I recall correctly so uh, right I need to produce copper tubes first of all I'll just dump oh wait no that's yeah alright I'll take that out put all that in and put that in as well. Um, oh, that's new. That wasn't there last time I used this. Copper tubes. Cop copper tubes. 
door module. There we are. And a breach replacement consumable. Alright. Uh, take item. Ah. Wrench. Oh yes, yeah. Oh yeah, I'm with you now. Okay. So I've got to replace the the damaged things. I'll put a door there. And I'll seal that one as well. Uh, damaged ceiling. Like so. Congratulations, you've completed the tutorial. More quests available in the radio. Now that you're on your own, discover what happened to the island. You'll need to upgrade the drill ship in order to reach other areas. Captain offers additional tutorial quests. When feeling lost, contact him. Looks like he's contacting me. I need a door. Uh. Oh, hey Connor. Yeah, you can watch from Twitch or YouTube, whichever suits you best. Uh, I've still got seven minutes till the next eruption. Uh, before progressing any further, gather enough coal to fuel the drill ship system. Power plants use coal to generate energy. Okay, uh, what else have we got? First travel, now that the drill ship is in great shape, or let's say good shape, let's move to another location, use the control panel and travel to a neighbouring landing site. Each time you travel, you do it the same way as now. If the drill ship has the required upgrades, it will take you to the location. Okay, and the last one, repair storage module. The storage module on the side of the drill ship is damaged. To produce and use a, tool, a repair kit, a repair tool to fix it. Make sure you have build, built, have the built, that's clunky, uh, and the repair kit in your inventory to start the repair process, procedure. Uh, okay, I think I do actually have, yes, I do actually have a module repair kit. There. Nah. So that's repaired. Everything else is in good Nick, uh, you can build an actual door. Yes, yeah. Don't worry. You you don't need to like guide me through everything. I'll uh, I'll. Oh wow, these are new. Oh, I need to stop doing that. Uh, I'll yeah. I'll remember as I go. Don't worry. Those are pretty cool though. Uh, oh, I need to stop doing that. Right, I'm going to see if I can change that in the controls because I keep pressing E after I've selected something and it's like, move every uh, everything you own into that box. Nope, nowhere to stop that, apparently. Oh, ah, yes there is. Right there. Okay. Now I will no longer do that. Nope, this will be my only stream today got a recording after this. Uh, normally I stream sort of this. Uh, it's, I, th this would have been my second stream of the day. Alright, uh, quest power plant. Component copper tubes. Module coal power plant. Pick up that. And then I need to place it. So I, I like to put uh, coal power plants in the roof if I can, I think. Okay, sure. I'll go there. What do you want, Captain? Raid cog drill ship. We need to get advanced cog technology that we can't produce ourselves. Or oh, one word. Raid a cog drill ship and take anything useful from its storage. They're specialised and you will always find the most items of a type in drill ships with specific, with a specific mission purpose. This means that most production items can be found in, in production cog ships. Check the map for more info. Alright. Uh, do you have any interest in Va Valorant? I've not heard of that. What is it? Is it a game? Sounds like a game. It's probably a game. 
All right, I want to clean up in here. This place is a mess. I'm just going to remove a load of stuff and then place it back down again. Uh, that's got stuff in it, so I'll just take that out and then move that. Uh, what's that thing? It's going to pick up everything. So it's nice and tidy in here. Is that part of the module? I honestly can't tell. It is not. There's a lot, a lot of new stuff that I'm just not familiar with at all. And I think my inventory is full. No? No, it's not. Just won't let me remove that for some reason. It's a new game like CSGO, but people have certain abilities. Oh, three minutes till. That, that's fine. It'll give me a warning close to the time. All right, so this is now a bit tidier. Uh, oh, yeah, that's the warning it gives me close to the time. All right, well, I'm not going to do anything up here, so let's head down. So it folds up all the modules, lifts up the door, and down we go. Oh, cool, there's a thing there. Can I remove that? I cannot. Ah, there's a bug currently you can't pick up the levers placed on the ground. Those ones, okay. So one downside with being underground is you're safe from attack, but you can't use modules. So you can access storage but um, you can sort of only access it directly, I think. I don't know. Alright, I'll just stay down here during the eruption. Um, I will place the periscope, though. Uh, periscope, there we are. Uh, I think I'm going to move the quest thing and I'll place the periscope there. What else do we have? Controller shut down. I don't know what that does. A work table. That might be just aesthetic. That's a chest. Uh, another chest. Production station. Right. I want this down here. I don't know what that is either. Ah. It's just a thing. Okay. All right, well, I'll have a production, a production, and a refinery. Uh, this can go up here, out of the way. Uh, the quest thing can also go up here. I can go, that can go there. Hey, Derpy Poster, how's it going? Oh, the item descriptions in the inventory. I honestly did not occur to me to do that. Thank you. All right, and at any time you can use the periscope to see what's going on at the surface. You can use this to check for uh, enemies and uh, resources, and also to watch the giant volcano that is about to erupt. Okay, Billy, you don't need to tell me about every comment. I'll see it when I go check the comments next. And that happens every, I think it was 25 or 15 minutes, one or the other. And if you get hit by that, it is not good. It leaves quite a wasteland that recovers shockingly quickly. But yeah, 25 minutes until the next eruption. So I don't think it's quite safe to surface yet. Uh, right. 
also you can sort of move around underground like this and find ores and the uh, your drill ship allows you to move through certain types of rock when you have certain upgrades and stuff right I need to go to the safe proving grounds or the safe was it safe grounds up here Here somewhere. Ah. So obviously the you can tell where you can and can't surface. You gotta avoid lava because that hurts you. I need to get a few of these. And now let's go to the cinematic camera. I've got it uh, disabled by default because it's kind of it can be kind of annoying when you're trying to do stuff and it keeps switching to cinematic, but I'm really glad they added an option to disable it. But there is the drill ship, which I have named the Far Wind, the Far Mine. Sorry, damn it! Practice this, the Far Mine. It's not very big, and there go the modules, and there's the uh, thingy on top. All right, things ringing. Hello, build a turret module. Module. Once you travel further, there is a high risk cogs will destroy your drill ship. Make sure you can defend it by building a turret module. Ah! Cock! Piss off. No! Stop it. Safe grounds, it says. Safe grounds! Ah. Anyway, uh, once the turret module is deployed, it automatically shoots at enemy units. Always make sure there is available turret ammo. So that stops stuff like, you know, them attacking you. Uh, repair storage module. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, storage module. Oof, that took like a lot of damage. You don't get like rewards for quests, it's just something to do. So, let's have a look at some of this stuff. Stats panel. The stats panel uh, is probably not very useful right now. It's basic information and until you sort of get further in I don't think it has a lot of use. Um, the map stand shows the island map. I have never used it so I'm just going to ignore that one. So let's move that stuff out the way. What else do we have? Panel manufacture small. Shows stats about power consumption, occupied core slots, and number of modules on a chosen module group. Each panel variant only shows one module group, refinery, production, or research. So I should have like a control room where I've got uh, these panels everywhere, the stats panel and the map stand. Okay, uh, there is also one chest, a work table. Oh, that is actually used for something. Works underground with no need for energy. Cool. Controller shutdown, remote access to all modules on the drill ship. Close all modules at once. That's cool. Display uh, shows, dis uh, shows selective items and tracks their amount. Oh, I see. Okay. So they've really added a lot for sort of micromanaging. Remote access to modules of a specific group. Okay. Right. So I guess up here should be my control. Let's just... Oh. There. So this will be my control room. Yeah, I can't remove that, which is annoying, but okay. So let's go with uh, stats panel I've already got. Controller shutdown. Ooh. Oh, wow. Huh. 
Uh, yeah, right, I'll put that there. Put that there. Don't need that. What's that one? Display. I'll do that one, that one for now. One of those. So that's the production. I think that's roof. I don't remember. All right, well, I'll put one there. I've only got the two. Uh, yeah, two of those there, sure, why not? And then down here, I'll have the workbench. And then... Ah, oh, well, let me put the uh, thingy above it. That's a shame. But I will put the other two there. It's not ideal. I'll improve it later. But I will use this. No, I'll use this one here for stuff I don't want to place. And I'll use this one here for consumables that I don't currently need. And this one here for consumables that I might need suddenly. Okay. Try to use the mounts on the walls. You can save a lot of space. The mounts, these ones. Controller. Is that what you mean? Nah, it's fine. It's fine as it is. I'll deal with it later. You can mount pretty much every device. Alright, I'll... Oh, I've got another one of those. Uh, I, I, I don't need that one either right now. Oh, did I accidentally place that? I don't know. Okay, so what's this one? Oh! That's a wearing noise. That's... Mm, that's the production. I... Oh, that's opening and closing them. Uh, that's also production for some reason. I didn't think that one was. Oh, because I, I just placed it again, didn't I? Oh, I can mount them on the walls. Oh, I see. They go on the little holes. I'm with you now. Oh, okay. That explains it. Right. Okay. All right. Let's try this again then, now that I've got that. All right, I don't need that. I'll take that one. That's why that can mount on the wall there, but not there. Now I understand it. Cool. Alright, I will empty this. And take that one. And put... Sure, a yellow chest, why not? Oh, cool, it's got a little display thing, so you can, like, have a thing indicating what's there. And that's red. What colour is that? Green. Sure, why not? Uh, right. And then... Alright, I'll take these as well. Alright, that clips through that, so I don't think I'm on that there. Alright, if I just put the... another one, let's see. Like so. No, I think I do want one over here for emergencies, you know? It's a bit annoying that the colour you, you can't actually see. Okay. Right, this will be the one for emergency stuff. Like so. So I've got Shells, I've got... Oh, I can't actually use the shells. I've got uh, revolver ammo, I've got med kits. This is for the stuff that I'm not currently going to be placing. Don't need that, don't need that right now. Uh, this one is for stuff that's useful that I do not currently need to use. And I can place the workbench there. Alright, cool. Sorted. Organised for now. Uh, anything you drill gets put into this uh, this storage and then I'll just drop it off in there 
So, now I have organised that. I think it is time we just got some more copper. And you can find like scrap down here as well. And you can get some cool stuff from that. Uh, there's a uh, hull damage, there's a temperature gauge, that's the uh, presumably the temperature at which I start taking damage. And I will pop up here and try and get on with some stuff. So I've got a few quests. I don't remember the quest button. I will look it up because I might have changed it. Quest log J. Ah, oh, J for journal. All right then. Hey Mimikyu. Hey Kanito. How's it going? All right. I need a turret module, and I need to raid somebody's ship. Hello? We good? Yeah, we good. Cool. So, open the module. Uh, yeah. Alright. So, I need to... Ah, oh, this is guiding me through how to make the... Um, the what's it called? Alright, two of those one of those and then turret ammo two of those produce the turret module so the way you can do it with this you see is uh, at one point I had like a line of them um, so like you, you have the uh, I had like a line of, of production stations all set to a specific thing so that I could just go okay like add five more of that five more of that rather than having to micromanage each one like this module I need the turret Ooh. take that take that so the turret module I will put right there next to the door because it, if there's the one place that needs to be defended it's the door speaking of which I'm gonna make a door mm, structure copper door hey Zach how's it going turret ammo low oh yes no don't shut that sorry I didn't mean to do that open it back up would you does it just fire out of the thingy? It might do. I didn't think it did, but... Right, what's the... There's the little question mark next to the thing, and I can't... I don't know how I read what that is. Hello, Luke. Uh, sure. No, don't do that. Yeah, if you click on them outside, it also folds them up. Wouldn't think there'd be space for that, but okay. Uh, copper door. Copper door, copper door, copper door. There. Actually, can I... Flip that round... Rotate. No. I was hoping I'd be able to s switch it around so that it opens that way, but no. I guess not. F1 for the question mark. Oh, okay. Opens up the archive thing. Thank you very much. <laughs> I wondered if it was that, Luke. <laughs> Uh, I got object there and in there okay so I have a turret I've got ammunition I've got I assume there's ammunition in this thing and uh, I guess I'm, I'm ready to go do another thing 
All right, this is for making basic stuff. A shotgun, I need copper tubes and a shredder. I actually have that. Copper tubes and a shredder. Copper tubes, please. Copper tubes. Tool and a shotgun. Immediately upgrade it to a bloody shotgun. Boom. Although I don't actually have the ammu uh, ammunition on me. And now I do. Cool. Can I make some more? How much is the shotgun shells? Sulfur powder. Sulfur powder. Make a load of that. Make a load of that. Cool. Uh, can you add two doors? One on the inside as well. Uh, maybe. I don't know. It's fanning. It's a bit hot in here. It's actually been quite a warm day. Okay, that is more shotgun shells than I intended to make, so I will leave most of them behind. Although I'm not sure I really need the revolver anymore, but okay. So I'll put the revolver in there. So I will take that. Ah, oh, no, no, I think I might need it for, like, longer range. Alright, I'll... Okay. So, I guess, let's have a look at the map. So there's an enemy drill ship over there. Okay, I remember I used to be able to send, send the far wind down. Call drill ship G. That was it. Yop you go. And I will see you later, you beautiful red bastard. Cool. We're off to see the drill ship, the wonderful drill ship of Cog. La 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 la. The beautiful drill ship of Cog. I've got seven minutes. It's fine. Until the next thingy. Right? Can I shift these around? No way. You can trash things. I guess not. Let's get that. Ah, there's a Cog. Can I set that to... Oh! Christ! Stealth Master, Master of Stealth! Ooh, shite! Whew. Combat's quite tense. Because it's so fast and brutal. Oof. Blast shelters. Oh, I see. One in each village. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, I saw there was a blast shelter update. Ah, that's how I switch gun. Headshots are brutally effective. Billy, I don't even know what nationality you are. There is currently no way to organise your harbour. Okay. Explore ahead. Uh, heads and stuff are used in uh, research. I mean, I'm not feeling massively healthy right now. So I might have to retreat and come back later. So there's, uh, yep, there's still nothing to do with these houses. There's big blocks of scenery. Uh, I will reload. No, oh, no, that doesn't need reloading. Oh! There's the second one. Whew. How's my ammunition? I'm doing okay. 15 shots left. I am probably going to have to retreat. 
less than half health. Alright, ah, there's another one. Oh, one shot. So you can easily find other drill ships because they've got the uh, smoke. And you can stealth, I think. Well, not very well, but you know. Decently. Hello? I'm not going to be stealthy. In case that... No, reload quicker. One. Oh, I got him. Thanks for checking in, GT, and I hope you have a good birthday tomorrow. Okay. Oh, my health is looking pretty bad. Okay, hopefully that's all of them. Oh, I do actually have a bloody health kit. Ah! I completely forgot I had health kits. No! Okay. Bloody hell, there's so many more of them. Alright, I've remembered there's a quick... quick loot button. Okay. Alright, I've got two minutes until the next er eruption. That's not really long enough to do anything, except get in here. And loot. No! Oh, this is gonna be difficult. I think I might just have to go back now. Unless I can get in this thing and take it down. Ah, there are now cog spawners. Okay, yeah, I am. I'm gonna have to go back. Clap. Clap. Please rise out of the ground. Anytime you want to, Farmine. Just rise from the ground where you are. There you are, thank you. Whew. I'm getting a bit hairy. I couldn't find a blast shelter. Oh. It's fine. When I when I know where the blast shelters are, I can rely on those, but for now I need the comforting warmth of the farm mine. But Down we go. That was a tad close. Restock on ammo, which I shredded through. Okay. Yeah, I'm glad I kept the uh, the pistol. Whew. So you can upgrade all of these modules, so you have better protection, uh, you move faster underground, uh, better drilling capabilities, uh, the, the number of segments you can carry, uh, and then the modules, I think, are these. Whew. That was a little bit close. I thought it would be easier to, to crack than that.
But I got a load of stuff. I can't uh, do anything with that at the moment. Papyrus. Oh, in character Papyrus. Oh, that's going to be a fun one. Sure. No idea how Papyrus will react to this situation until he does, you know? Hello, I'm Papyrus. Why am I in a big box? Why is everything made of metal? Hmm. There is a, a valve here. Turning it makes ominous noises. There is a valve here. Turning it makes more ominous noises. Let's go back to the surface. Oh. Everything seems a bit wonky. Energy is not looking very good. Core is at zero out of a hundred. But I don't think that works when you're traveling through. Ah, it doesn't. Good. Core is at 40. Modules are at six. Hello. The surface is a lot less green than I thought it would be. Okie dokie. What is that thing here? Valve. That's very worrying when it makes those noises. I think I'm going to get rid of it to stop me from making those noises. Let's just get rid of all of them, and then I can't accidentally break myself. Stick them in there, they'll be safe. Okie dokie. So, what now? Um... I guess I should do some refining. Sure, let's refine all of them. And production, I don't really know what I need. Grenades could be useful. Ah, there are now lights and a banners and a research station three copper tubes and one sulfur powder three copper tubes and on this one uh, oh I don't have a research module forgot about that Ah, controllers and valves currently do not work. Okie dokie. I don't have anything to do with that. I guess I need to go and attack another sh Oh, I will try and make some grenades. What was I going to do? I've already forgotten. Tool? No. Grenade? No. Module? No. Oh, is the research station. Alright, ammunition, no. Tool, grenade. Tubes, bolts, and sulfur. Alright, tubes. And bolts. And sulfur, I'm full. I have no sulfur. I have no sulfur at all. I cannot make grenades. I'm just going to try and do... I'm just going to send the far mine down into the great beyond. And I'm going to go and do the same thing that I did before. Do I have enough ammunition? Probably not. Let's go! Yay! There are people like me. Wait, I'm not a robot. Sans, am I a robot? I don't know. Ah! I'm being attacked! I'm just going to run away. As great a warrior as I am, I'm not 
going to be here right now. Thanks for playing. Oh look, a ship. I wonder whether they have goodies inside. I will go and find out what goodies they have. I cannot see the enemy for the enemy indicators. How philosophical. Stop shooting me, please. No. That button. Alright, I need to see if there's a quick way to close my bloody inventory again. Is it just... Look, tab opens... Oh, tab does close it. Never mind. Does it work with this? Yes, it does. Never mind. I take back what I didn't almost say. Hello? Hello? Ah! I'm being flanked. They must be masters of this. Use the Healy kit, please. Use the Healy kit, please. Use the Healy kit, please. You bastard. Uh. Okay, it auto saves every five minutes. Which is useful when I die a lot. And I will die a lot. Imagine doing a permadeath of this. I mean, imagine dying because I am a master warrior and has never died. I'm a master. And I will attack them with my amazing gun. I feel like I don't have enough ammunition. Can you ever have enough ammunition? Yes. It's when you kill everybody. Then everybody is dead and there is no more need to have ammunition. Right. I'm just going to ignore him and hope he ignores me. But him... Okay, there are a lot of them and I cannot see them for the warnings. This is really annoying. I don't like that they continually spawn now. Okay. Whew. Oh, right. Let's try this again. I feel I should heal before I approach. Medkits are more disposable than I am. Hello? It's, um, your local newspaper delivery boy. I am here with your newspaper. Knock, knock! Oh, there are so fucking many of them! Luckily they got stuck on each other's corpses. That is a common mistake among people bad at fighting wars. Knock, knock. No, I am Papyrus. Hello. Don't do that. Don't... I don't know who is shooting at me. I think they're shooting at me from out. Oh, there. There were like 15 people upstairs. Uh, 
Um. Ah. There. Whew. Okay. Whew. Jesus. That was hairy. Sorry, thought I heard noise. Okay. Right. Now I can loot the place. Let's take everything I can. I don't want the periscope. Storage. Nice. <laughs> You've been looted, buddy. <laughs> uh, uh, there's uh, another classic, classic Garen prank. <laughs> okay, time to bugger off. Uh, and I am going the wrong direction, it is this way. Whew. Okay. That went, that went okay, actually. That went all right. The spawners are, are reasonably easy to destroy. Two shots with the shotgun. That might, they might be harder on, sort of higher tier. Am I still going in the right direction? No. It might be harder on slightly higher tier things, but that wasn't too bad. And I reckon grenades would have made things a whole lot easier. And I still have a sing something. Any suggestions for what I should sing for the uh, for Flaffy's one? While I call up the farm mine? I do like how it sort of shows that your ship is there. It doesn't just like spawn there and pop up or whatever. It spawns a fair way underground. Whew. Hey, farm mine. Okie dokie. Now I dump off everything I just got. There we go. Raid successful. Install drill ship segment. The drill ship is getting short on space. Produce and install the segment upgrade. Uh, we're getting short on storage. Build one more storage module. Okie dokie. I don't know... I don't know what their song is. Uh, Sam. I'll put those two in there. Put... That in there. Put that there, and then that one in there. Okie dokie. Alright, I'm gonna... Put that there, put that there. Cool. Right. Uh, longer drill ship production menu. Module, device, structure, upgrade, upgrade, here we are. All right, sure, build one of those. No, I'm not familiar with the song, Sam. Oh, your welcome is a good song. I don't think I know the lyrics well enough. Produce a chest. I don't need a chest. But okay, sure. I get maybe I need it for the. Uh... Oh yeah, I do. I need it for the thing. <laughs> Fair enough. Storage.
I keep looking that way for the storage. So I might need to swap those round. I think I'll... S oh, I can't swap it round unless it's empty, I don't think. And I can't hold everything. Toradamolo, yeah, I know. There. Um... I guess I can put the other storage there. Sure. Okay. Nope, sorry, I don't know that song either. I don't know a lot of songs, guys. I don't, <laughs> don't know if... Yeah. And all of that goes in there. And, oh yeah, those as well. And the ammo. Although I do need more turret ammo. It makes a weird blippy noise when I put that in. Or a blippy noise sometimes. Uh, copper bolts. Component. Five copper bolts. And ammunition. Cool. Alright. Drill, 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 drill. Here. Oh, sorry, I do it underground. Of course I do. Because underground is a much easier and more logical place to install a part of the drill. I should have used that. That's a cool one. Uh, why have I got two power plants? Oh, because I stole them! Nice. Alright. I'll stick them in there for now. I appreciate the hints, Fire Dragon, but let me discover stuff on my own, please. If I'm really stuck on something, I'll I'll sort of ask. But I like to discover stuff on my own as much as I can. There we are. Prepare for attack. We need to attack the cog drill ship again, but this time take more than just items. We need to destroy the modules and take technology. This will require better weapons. Produce they expected me to do that whole thing with just the revolver. Bloody hell. Produce grenades, shotgun, and shotgun shells. Okie dokie. So, I have the stuff, but I do need to go mining for sulfur. Because I'm very short on sulfur. There's some sulfur up near the lava. Makes sense. And there's some more sulfur. I'll just go get this one first. Hmm. I've been I've been listening to uh, aviators like on constant repeat for the last two weeks. Uh. I discovered them shortly before the lockdown and they're all I've been listening to. Well, I didn't... I, I'd say I discovered them. I heard a few more of their songs that I just fell in love with. Uh, songs uh, inspired by Five Nights at Freddy's of all bloody things. I mean, I hate horror and uh, would never play it, but I enjoy the lore of Five Nights at Freddy's, or at least Game Theory's interpretation of it. And uh, I think it makes very good source material for a song for, for songs so Aviator's Sweet Dreams is just pure gold uh, then there's also uh, Our Little Horror Story and Jaws as well which are both pretty good so I highly recommend those oh yeah you can also go down deeper underground Uh, is that enough now? 23, that's not bad. Uh, that shows that there is a cog ship there. Actually, I can have a look. Hello. Blind git. 
I don't know that I could do them any degree of justice, Sam. I have been singing um, Sweet Dreams quite a lot. It's a bit of a grim song, I will warn you. Um, as it is based on Five Nights at Freddy's 4, which is about giant, monstrous animatronics trying to murder a child. But I, I highly recommend them. Sung by someone better than me, preferably. Right, where am I going? Safe grounds. No. Safe grounds weren't very safe last time I looked. Alright, fine, I'll go there. And I will stick them in there. It is full. Because it's because it's uh, it's not open, so that stuff will all be combined when it opens. I can't remember how it begins. Um, is that one open? Yes, it is. Cool. So I should be able to access. Yeah, sixty-four. Nice. So I surfaced and it moided somebody. I say somebody. Something. You, specifically. Ooh. Cool. Ah, I've got my second module. Oh yeah, yeah, I've got my second module. Forgot about that. Because it's, it's blocked. Would you, please... <laughs> Coming from the same place. Oh. Aim for this fucking head, would you? I cannot believe I missed every single one of those bloody shots. I love FNAF lore, it desensitises the concept of murdered children. It makes it commonplace, you know? It's the norm. What, only five murder children? Oh, there's nothing. <laughs> okay. So, this is my new section. I'm being shot at again. God's sake. Uh, that one, that one. Sorry, I keep getting the wrong key bindings to, like, auto-loot. Uh, how's the damage looking? Ah, uh, the front of the drill took, took a bit of damage. Right, I'm just going to get on with stuff, and I'm going to trust my turret to do its job. If they attack from that direction, I'm screwed, but I attack from that one, I'm fine. Okay, so I've got space for, like, six more modules back here. Uh, yeah, so I've got seven modules, presumably seven of seven means I've got seven installed and none destroyed. Oh, my power's going up, that'll be from the uh, the reactors. Um, what's this? Oh, is that the roof one? Yeah, I think it is. Uh... Alright, what I like to do is put a turret sort of at the end of each thing. So like there, there, there and there. Oh okay, seven are open, I see. Um, oh for fuck's sake, that is so annoying. Constantly getting bloody attacked. Alright. Well, let's make all of that. And a load of that as well. Buckshot. 
I have plenty of buckshot. I don't need to make more. But grenades, I do. Tool. Is that enough? I need to make four, it says. Pick up shotgun from storage. I'll pick up the grenade. Time for the raid. The objective is to destroy production and refinery modules and extract technology. Make sure you have all the weapons ready, as some are hard to take down. We will need the destroyed module technology for research and unlocking upgrades. The alarm signifies being attacked. And also the incoming eruption. Uh, Alright, drop that off, drop that off, drop that off. Alright, if I load up on stuff... Alright, that siren means we're, uh, we're about to, you know, have a, an eruption going on. Alright. Like so. So now I'm ready. So I'll go down. Ooh. And while I'm down for the next minute, I will look up the lyrics for Sweet Dreams. Because once I get started, I'll know it. I just can't remember how it starts. Does he have the lyrics in the description? He does. Oh yes, that was it. I'm underground, aren't I? Yes, I am. <laughs> Had to double check. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> really self-conscious about singing. I don't know if you know that about me. Screw it. Let's just take everything. No. Alright, I want to save the inventory space. Okay. I'm ready for when the world is ready for me. Yup, we go. I'll send Farmine back under under underwater underground. Oh wow! You can put them bloody everywhere. It's like you can put it above the door. That would work because if you have like a whole section for like production, you then put it above the door, and excuse me, and at a glance you can see how your production is doing. Okay, Farmine. I will see you in the next life. Take care, my baby. Take care, daddy will be home soon. Here we go. Uh, where am I going? It's not M, it's F. I'll go left. Ah, oh, you can light your shit at sh Sorry, that was a slip. <laughs> you can light your ship up. <laughs> that was completely unintentional. Uh, it's like the old old joke. They were uh, when learning about um, there was a, always a topic in history that would always make us laugh when discussing ship money, because the teacher would always just gloss over the pronunciation and say ship money. Lots of ship money. Going well so far, going well so far. We're approaching the door. Looks like they lead their shots just as well as I do. Better than I do. Alright, switch to the shotgun. Knock, knock. Hello, Nils. 
It's okay if they, they say they like it. Oh my god, hello. It's okay if they're just saying they like it, as, as long as they don't like constantly ask about it and stuff. Okay. Well, this is now mine. I own it. I'm going to destroy it. What have you got? Uh, scrap station, yeah, that's useful. So it's me having to build one. Storage module. Ooh, destroyed research module, that's pretty good. Pilot seat, refinery station. I don't have a lot of inventory space, so I might have to get rid of stuff, but we'll see. The only reason I'm using this ammunition is like, is uh, I need to clear the space really. Right, I should also just. Oh! I need to clear the space from my inventory. Hello? 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 Cool, got that. Hello. Gotcha. Anything else? Oh. If I deploy it, I can't deploy it for some reason. Maybe because I've shot it a lot. Fine, job done. Uh, inventory full. Okay, what do I not need? I haven't used the grenades. All right, I'm going to say I don't... Oh, no, I can just combine that. Never mind. Cool. Uh, what's that one? That's a refinery module, I think. I want it. I'll switch to this one. No, that's the wrong one. It's that one. Much easier. Cool. Alright, that's all I needed from here. Ah! Ooh, it's gun shot after he died. That's a nice touch. Alright, as I'm full on stuff, the map says go this way. And off we go. And I'm desperately trying to work up the courage to sing um, sw uh, Sweet Dreams. I'm just really, really self-conscious about this. So, what? That's why I tend to go for sort of sillier, lighter, more casual songs rather than ones that, you know, I, I actually really bloody like. No, I don't have the inventory space for it. Oh, yes, this is the right place. I was going to say, this looks like my place, but... Oh, there is a green boy there. Fucking shot his head off. Shot your head off. You don't got no head, buddy. Oh, at least they slowed down the rate at which everything goes back to green. I think last time I played, everything was green again within like a minute. Safe and sound. And in everything goes. Nice. What do you want, Captain? Since cogs are active all over the island, they leave some of their tech behind once work once done with the work. Check the map for colour triangles to locate sites for technology. 
go there and try some try to find some of the destroyed modules okay yeah that's underground like the ones I, f I found before all right well I'll put those in there put those in there put those in there oh, I missed a couple of bits um okay cool and I guess I'll put scrap station there and the refining station there and I'll leave that up here no actually so at the moment, there are only two things I can actually use, uh, I can actually refine. So if I put one in each, you see, I can just pop in here and go, right, I need five more copper bars, I need 17 more sulfur ore. What's this one for? Oh yes, this is for like scrapping stuff back down into usable things. Ooh, bloody hell, look at my health. Okie dokie. Cool. Nope, we're good. Probably going to need to do some repairs, actually. Uh, this one. Module repair. You're okay. You're okay now. I'm hoping that they're just targeting the the big thing, but I've previously had them like blow holes in the back of like the back modules. Ooh. Everything else okay? Yeah, everything else is okay. Nice. I would like to put another door on the front so that I can get out either side if I want to. So let's do that now module door and you can produce a door windows aren't particularly good given that you can't really see I mean they're okay they they're all right but they're not they're not great there we are uh, where is your health it is the red bar in the bottom left corner there we are now I can leave either side which means I do need a turret module here so I need to move the refinery module further back I shall put that there uh, oh sorry <laughs> of course it is it's covered by the event tracker I'm so sorry about that. Uh, event list. No, nope. event list. There you go. Alright. Sorry about that. I need to remember to adjust my display depending on the game. Uh, that's a turret, that's a storage, that's a production. So the production there. Freeing up space at the front. I want to get... Oh, I can't get that down. I like the um, thingies being in the top. Uh, I do need another turret though. So, what do I need for another turret? I need copper tubes. Plates and tubes. Wow, that's not, not a lot. Plates and tubes. All right, let's make three of those. I really want to cover myself, you see. Cover myself in turrets. Just slather my body in turrets. And two of those as well. I'm using six energy and I'm gaining ten. 
Uh, I've got two empty things here. One's going to be a turret. Like so. And then in the back here... Turret and turret. The Derrick factory. Ah, oh, let's have a look. There we go. I'm well defended. So I'm still vulnerable from the back, but this this back bit can't actually be damaged. There's nothing here, you see. They have to go to the sides, at which point they will be shot by the turret. Okay. Oh, shit, there's a window here. Okay, well... There we are. It's a variant on the um, the door one you see to place a window. I forgot about that. Huh. That's interesting. Shit, I'll get rid of that again. Huh. So you can either have it plain with a logo, with a, an interact point, a mount point, or, yeah, cool. So this one's with the interact point. I just figure it's best to have as many interact points as possible. So what can I put on them? Anything, he said. But like lights, pretty much just lights. Probably lights and banners. Okay. Mm. Oh, I'm now losing more power than I'm generating. So isn't it so lucky that I have two more power plants? Like so. So now I'm generating 20. Stole them from one of the ships. Okay. Show. Sure. I'm under attack again. I think I'm going to make some more ammunition. No material. What, what are you missing? Copper bolts. And that's why it's good to have uh, two of these. Can you eventually paint it? I don't actually know. I'd assume not. I haven't seen any like different coloured ones in promotion lab, but I'm sure Fire Dragon can answer. Oh. Okay, I need more research and production modules for me to complete the quest. Guess I'm loading up and heading back out. Why is that in there? Um, did I really use all that fucking ammo? Ooh, okie dokie. It's planned to make players able to paint their ships, maybe even with colour patterns. That'd be nice. Okay, take more of those, and take some more of those, but I will leave two of those behind. But I will take that and that. Okay, I've got eight minutes. That's not long enough to go on a raid. God, can you imagine if it's like every 15 minutes? Yeah, the moment it erupts, you just got to go straight out. Oh, wait, hang on. I could be entirely wrong. I think it might be underground these deposits is pointing me towards. Or not. No, it's saying just go to the surface. Whatever. I'll go back to the surface as soon as I can. No, we don't allow links here. We've heard too many people 
spamming and self-promoting, I'm afraid. It's fine. People can look up the roadmap if they want to see. Garion River Blue with gold trims. Oh, I would love that. Yes, yeah, that's a good idea, actually, Cookie. Yeah, put it in the Discord in uh, in uh, Hash Gaming. Oh, Garion River Blue. Rim. Not Rim. Why was I going to call it the Rimmer? Why on earth was I going to call this the Rimmer? The Farmine. I'm so sorry, Farmine. I almost called you Rimmer. Alright, uh, you head back down. I'm going to go mining. I'll see you in a bit, buddy. Yeah, there are things... There are actually other places. Can you come back? Screw it. <laughs> it's fine. I can't be bothered. I'm just going to run. Uh, nice bit of cardio. Whew. Go for a jog. Around the robot-infested island. <sighs> so how is everyone today? Still haven't got the courage to sing yet. Got to be close there, but no, not quite. So how's everyone doing today? It's quite warm here. I uh, popped out to the shop earlier. Saw a guy on a bench eating his lunch. Very, very nearly went over and said, you know, you're allowed to leave for exercise, but you're not supposed to be just coming out and sitting in a park eating your lunch. I was talking to somebody else about this, and they were like, well, what, what if that was his, his, like, his daily exercise? He goes to the park and he eats lunch. That's not... No, that's just... That's a loophole. You know, that's, that's not doing it right. It's not supposed to be have your exercise go to a public place and just be there. It's supposed to be your exercise as you keep moving so you don't come into contact with other people who sat next to a bloody path eating his lunch. All they had to do, all someone had to do was walk past, sneeze, and boom! Another infected idiot. Anyway, I don't want to talk about it. I don't know why I brought it up. I'm sorry. It, just, it was on my mind. I just had to rant about it a little. Oh, no! Okay, I'm just going to ignore him and run straight past. It's warm here as well. Need to keep a window open half the time. Yeah, I, 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 yeah. If it gets too hot, I will have to start having a, a window open during streams. But for now, ah, sorry, maybe jump. Could you please stop shooting me and die? Very unnecessary, your attitude towards me. Right. Shut up. I think you have a friend. Either that or is your thing again. I think there was a bug before where they used to stand inside buildings and shoot. Right. Blast shelter. So there should be one around here. Piss off. Occupado. I'm doing alright, yeah. God, they've got ridiculous range. And I've, I'm almost out of health again. Do da, do da. Almost out of health again. Quickly heal me up. Quickly heal me up. Thank you. Right, let's try and find this thing. Hmm. I don't see anything that's blast sheltery. Please do not tell me where it is. Yeah. I think, I assume they have different weapons. Like one's a shotgun, one's a... Aha! Gotcha!
Blast Shelters are creation, creations, plural, or a creation of the island population who built them just in case of an unlikely volcanic eruption. I see a guy come in. Okay, I've got two minutes to try and work out how to get in there. Where was I? <clears throat> uh, they would never guess how good an investment they would become. Doors can be destroyed with regular weapons and tools. Alright then. I guess it's just like a, a little... A little place to hide. That's a cool idea. Not much to them, but... I suppose it would be a bit OP if they were. They're not supposed to be a... a an alternate base, they're just a place to hide so you don't have to always pop back to your thing every every like five minutes or whatever it is on the hardest settings. Ugh. Ugh, sorry, it's stretching. Okay. I'll just hide down here then until the eruption has passed. I tried Animal Crossing New Leaf and I didn't like it at all. I haven't played the, the new one and I'm, I'm very unlikely to as I don't have a Switch. But I found New Leaf very, very shallow. Com I compared it at every turn to um, Stardew Valley. And Stardew Valley has like a carefully designed town with carefully designed people. Uh, and... Animal Crossing, it's all random, and they're idiots. They're just random number generators that say, this thing is cool, this thing is not cool, and endlessly repeating one catchphrase. I would love a bunker under my house. It is genuinely one thing that I absolutely want to get. A fallout shelter on my property. Uh, so that's something I'll, I'll want to get in the future. But compared to Stardew, I couldn't get into Animal Crossing. I think if I hadn't played Stardew first, Animal Crossing would seem better. But it was just so underwhelming for me. <sighs> Can you hear me okay over the, the game? I don't know what the balancing is like. Like, can you hear me now when it's being noisy? Or during the shooting, for example. Is it chef? I don't look very chef. Okay, now it's chef. Oh, lovely. Lovely post-nuclear explosion, or post-volcanic, whatever. Alright, on my way back, I'll hit that place up. It looks like this stuff respawns after an eruption. Oh, they are surfacing. So I want to get past before they see me. So that's a research one, I think, with the two test tubes. Sulfur, oh, that's nice. Copper, I don't really need. That's also sulfur, but where am I going from here? I think right. That's a production one, and that was another research one. They look like weird monkey people. Just gonna follow them up here. Oh, if I can. I played New Leaf and it bored the crap out of me. I played the new one because my friends pressured me into it and it's actually quite fun. I, yeah, I didn't like 
just the way everything was so random and pointless. Stardew you, feels like you're building a life. When everything's random and, and so no one has any personality except Isabel. I mean, I liked Isabel. She was adorable. But you can't build a game on... Um, on one character alone. I'm a little low on health, so I'm going to heal again. Thanks, Billy. You don't need to tell me about every single comment. I, I'll see them. Don't worry. I check my comments like 17 billion times a day, so I really wouldn't worry about me missing it. Any others here? Skyrim in the mountains, yeah. Uh, it's the best way to get around. Uh, after watching the monkeys do it. Do you think this is post-apocalyptic um, forest? Do you think the, the mountain from the forest just erupted one day and robots came pouring out of it? That was what the third artifact did. It turned them into robots. It all makes sense now. Uh, right, how am I doing on storage? Not great. But I want to use my grenades. Isabel is, is pretty damn good. And without her, the game wouldn't stand a chance. But I don't know that she is enough. I mean, that, that said, I do think that the smallest thing can make a game, so maybe one character can. I've been playing Arknights a lot. And uh, in that, what started off as just a quest to get a single character, single operator, uh, Exusier, has sort of grown. So now, oh no! I was scratching my head. Alright, they're quite slow, but quite close range. So I'm guessing the greens are, are long range snipers, the blues are, sh are mid range uh, sort of combat, and the reds are short range shotguns. Hello, green plumber boy. Don't shout at Restream. Restream does a very important job here. It's so that both streams, both the YouTube and Twitch streams, can communicate with each other. Take that, thank you. It's pilot seat. Take all of that, thank you. Ooh, nice. Take all of those. Mm, scrap station. Ah, I don't think I need a second one. Uh, I could destroy stuff while I'm here. I was going to say no harm, no foul, but you know what I mean. Grenade! Oh yeah, there's no, like, delay on them. They just fucking pop. Ah! Right, I kind of want his head. Uh, cool. Alright, I'm gonna leave... that. I still don't have any space. Damn it! Alright, I'm going to leave the copper tubes. What else do I want? Uh, there's production, another refinement one. That is so good at that. Okay. Um... I might as well just destroy the whole thing while I'm here.
Ah! I always, I get so freaked out, because it always surprises me. I don't hear them coming, ever. What's that then? Oh, it's just the, the inventory. Okay. So, they're still... Okay. Success. Oh, it floated. Quite casually. Nice. And now... I need to drop something else. So, more tubes. In order to get whatever that was, which I think was just scrap. The bot is other comments. It's people in the other chat. Nice. Uh, let's get rid of that. There. Consumed. I've consumed this entire drill. There. It's gone now. It's mine. And now that it's clear, I should be able to get him to come to me. That's amazing. That is such a good addition. Because I don't think that was in the previous time I played. Like, you called them and they just popped back up where they were. Whew. Oh, the ground's very strong and also don't ask so many questions. <laughs> Hello? Come here. Come here, come here for a cuddle. Come here for a cuddle. Oh, who's a good giant drill? Who's a good giant drill? I think you may have anger issues, Green Plumber Boy. If you get so angry about a bot, just in general. Let's stick all of that in there. And these as well, and those, and that, and that, and that, and that. I got a really good haul from all that. Uh, stick those in there, stick those in there. So I'm out of grenades. I've got two reinforced hull parts. I think they're used for research. So I'll stick them in there for now. Ah. Well, the restream reposting comments isn't uh, sort of essential. In character as who? Let's get a different character in here. You didn't say which character, Mimic. What character would you like? Uh, but yes, the, the restream thing isn't um, essential. So I can see both chats, whether it reposted or not, but I thought this way it it was a way for people to communicate. It, you know, it, it, it expands the, the thing, so it's not like two separate conversations going on, you know? How's my ammunition doing? Eight. Yeah, I'm doing fine. Uh, I guess I'll just very quickly go and see if anyone is healing. fine, that's fine, that's fine. And the back. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Nice. Sans. Okay. Alright then. Ten minutes of Sans. <laughs> Hello. I'm Sans. I've realised during the editing that Sans and Lizzie are very, very similar sounding. But there is a slight difference. Build research devices. Now it's time to focus on further upgrading the drill ship. <laughs> Without upgrades, we can't pro uh, progress to other areas of the island. First, you have to build the devices that allow you to do the research. 
I repaired it, didn't I? Didn't I? What's damaged? Oh, I didn't check the ones in the roof. Okay, I need a research module. I could just make it straight away. Sorry, that one was Lizzie. Research module. I'll put you there. Sans does tell puns, damn. Um, did I ever tell you about the time I... Oh, I can't remember what Sans is like. It's been so long. Papyrus, I, I do actually remember. I, I guess I'll see more of Sans since I stopped doing the series. Like I watched... Uh, I've seen a few playthroughs of his fight. Right, a research station. Uh, I guess that can go here. Hello. Now that we have all devices up and running, we can progress towards improving the drill ship. First, we need to research how COG technology works by gaining intel from disassembled tech. Okie dokie. What are we doing then? Upgrade. Okay. I don't know how many of those I got. Let's find out. I got seven. Seven of those. Jevil? I don't remember Jevil. See one of the other monsters? I don't know. They're all, they're all the same to me. <laughs> I'm only kidding because I am one of them. Or I'm not? It's hard to tell. I'm a bit vague about that kind of thing. Should I put... Ah! You could just put any symbol. That's a really nice touch. That's a really, really nice touch. Well, I'll put uh, that one, and on this one, it will be the ammunition buckshot. Nice. Ah, Delta Rune. Not played that. Uh, there's about an hour left. Hey, Fire Dragon. Welcome back. I'm Sans. <laughs> I'm not very good at the Sans, if I'm honest. What's going on? Hmm. Not a lot. Really? Delta Rune could be a very good stream idea. I'll have to look into look into it. Managed to do it with with uh, Undertale. So now what am I doing? Hey, Fluffy. That's a funny name, isn't it? It's like Fluffy, but Flaffier. Uh, I'm really bad at sounds. Sorry. Um, I'm just waiting for that then, aren't I? It takes ages. So, in the meantime, I'm going to make a couple of lights. Ooh, standing ones. Ah, there's a light. lights there there we 
How is it? Yeah, it's pretty good. Pretty good. To make the production faster, produce and install an additional production module. In general, the more open modules of a type you have, the faster work goes. This applies for a refinery and research too. Okay. Upgrade basic production researching takes a lot of time and energy. Still, it is the only way to move forward. Gather all the needed items for research in the upgrade. Once ready, see the research station upgrades tab and begin researching the upgrade. Ah, uh, see, Mimikyu's are better sans than sans is. <laughs> uh, right, I need a second one of those then. Upgrade basic research. Upgrade production. What are you doing? Now that we have all devices up and running... Yeah, we've done that one. Uh, ah, that's where it'll go. Right there. Fantastic. Production is now double speed. I'm alright. I'm just a bit tired, you know. Oh look, an arm. Is it an arm? Could be a leg. I'll give you hand, mate. <laughs> oh, it must have been his. Nope, still don't know what it was. Could have been anything. Nowhere to know. So many people just throwing themselves. Alright, what are the red ones then? Let's have a look. A miner. Sentry. Builder. And explorer. Okie dokie. Right, now what? Well, that goes in there, that goes in there, and that goes in there. And that goes in there. I'm now only gaining two, which means I need a better power module. How do I get a better power module? I don't think that I do. Probably going to need to put an extra thing in there. One of those. Like so's. Ah, see, you're all better at these puns than I am. Uh, that one. And... That one. Hello. Destroy Cogship Tier 2. For this quest, you'll have to change yourself into a demolition unit. Equip yourself with enough ammunition and grenades. The mission is to completely destroy a Tier 2 drill ship and obtain parts of a hardened drill. They're necessary for manufacturing hardened drill for your drill ship. Otherwise we can't move on. To destroy the drill ship you have to destroy all modules. Make sure to reclaim any other parts of the drill ship once it's destroyed. Well I got improved parts for the, what was it, the tracks? Hull. The reinforced hull. Uh, I can now get tier 2. Uh, well, let's get a load of these. How many do I have of the red ones? Six. Ugh. I'm enjoying this so far. Ooh. Sorry, I didn't do a very good in character for that. I apologise, I'm really not very good at Sans. It's been too long since I played it, so I just I don't remember enough about his particularisms. Whereas Papyrus, I sort of I know because he's a bit more distinct in my mind. I mean Sans is very distinct, but I know him more for like peak moments rather than his demeanour, if that makes sense. 
<sighs> Excuse me. Core. I need to upgrade my core. Hmm. I don't know how I upgrade my core. Don't tell me. Yeah, I'm probably going to have to find the core parts from a thingy. A tier 2. That's a hell of a lot of reinforcement. Wow. Yeah, people do like sands, don't they? Scottish. Okay then, straight from sands into Scottish. Hello. I'm. Sc oh, hang on, I forgot to start the thing. Start the timer. Ominous yet jolly. Yeah, I only managed to do the uh, the occasional. <laughs> I couldn't do the ominous very well. Hello, I'm Scottish. I wonder what there is out there. Oh, some robe, robe. I I don't know how Scottish person would say that word. Um, drunk people. That's what they are. Uh, Christ! Look at that big bastard. He's he's giant and he's spewing smoke and fire. Ah. How's the research coming? I don't know. Anything else I can do? Oh, I might. Ah, oh, no, hydraulics I don't have. I wasn't very keen on her. Ah, I can make a window module now. No, Alfie's just didn't do much for me. Explosives on tight on a timer. Uh, length is spelt wrong. There's a typo in change time leng hit by clicking a right mouse button. Throw and run. Highest damage is at explosion epicenter. That's quite cool. Ah, oh, here's where I make the the core two. I see. I'm with you now. Okay, doggy. Fine. Let's go down then. If that's what you, we really have to do. Ooh, gonna be causing this one a little bit. Fine. Excuse me. Uh, I won't be streaming tomorrow. Uh, I've got D and D tomorrow, and I need to do some work. I reckon, uh, and because East, uh, Sunday is Easter Sunday, I, I won't be streaming on Sunday either. So my next stream will be probably Monday, and I don't know if I'll be streaming once or twice but if it's once I'll do another vote no it's, I'll do a vote on Sunday to decide what I'm streaming on Monday I'm not I'm not entirely sure if people are, are enjoying this and I'm I'm rather enjoying this it's got a bit of movement to it you know I think I've progressed quite far in a short time. So, ah. I'm tempted to put a second, uh, a second tier on this one. What do I need for that? Iron plates, crystal and boiler. I just don't have any of that. Oh, let's use this. Landing site occupied by drill. No, it isn't. Oh, you giant bastard. What are you doing? It's gone Russian somehow. I do not know how. Fine. Let's go somewhere else. 
apparently is not good enough. I have to go elsewhere. Oh, I'm sorry. That you're... You want to use my landing site. You know, I, I, I killed somebody to get that landing site. You can't just decide it's yours. Ugh. Right, time to surface and see what we're gonna do. Until the next eruption. Well, I need to go and destroy a cog drill ship tier 2. That sounds hard. In the meantime, I, I, I guess I don't have much else to do, so I'll load myself up and go do that. Although I'm almost out of med Ah, oh, no, I've got plenty of medkits. I do need grenades, though. I don't have any grenades again. And I'd love to get those, but iron bolts... I don't have any iron bolts. What am I missing? Copper tubes. Ah, I can now make slugs with iron stuff because I've got the tier 2 iron. Seven grenades, that's pretty good. Uh, I do need more buckshot though. I don't have a lot of that left. Now I've got a lot of that left. I'll just go buck wild. <laughs> I'm just going to shoot them a fuck of a lot. Where am I going? Uh, let's have a look at the map. I've not seen any places. I guess I could go searching for them. Or I could just go over and attack the nearest one like that one. Uh, I don't know. I don't quite know. Oh, I can upgrade the basic refinery. Uh, what is this for? Uh, produce Intel production T1. Why would I do that when I don't need to do that? I've already done that. Fine. Whatever. Sure, make a second one. Whatever makes you happy. And I'm going to leave you working. You can defend yourself, right? Yeah, you're good. Right, um, they're all tier 1, but I don't think I can beat a tier 2 right now. I'll just go, sure, I'll just walk down this cliff. That's what's apparently where I'm going. Okay, here we are. Fucking shot your head off. Reload quicker. Stop shooting over his head. Oh, shite. Heal me. Oh, Christ. Just two of them on a hill and I couldn't fucking hit them. Right, where am I? Why is it ringing? Oh, stop going on about the storage repair. Screw that. Okay, I was all ready for the, to leave and go on my mission. Okay, off I go. I'll try not to die this time. Oh. I hope you you like the voices I do. What is that? Oh, piss off. Just piss off, would you? All right, time for you to go down. It's much safer underground. 
Alright, let's try and do this without dying again. Oh, shite. There's just so many of them and the combat is so annoying. Fuck off! Jesus, it's so annoying! Ugh. Ugh. Oh, I'm just gonna leave it fucking ringing. Whatever. Let's go down, would you? Deal with you later. One more time, let's try this. Guess I'm being attacked by these pricks. They always seem to hit. That's the fucking die. I it's, it's, it can be really awkward to hit them. But they always seem to hit, no matter what I fucking do. Like you can't dodge it. You just have to tank hits all the time. Oh, there's so fucking many of them here. Reload your twat. Get behind a tree and heal. Fucking die when I shoot you! Oh, two more. Fucking grand. That's what I needed. More of them. More of them with their hit scan fucking weapons that can't be dodged! Mm. Oh, sorry, I'm getting really irritated over that. Oh. Oh, that was fucking irritating. Oh, my hands hurt now. Alright, I'm not going for that one again. Just going down a hill, you're just suddenly surrounded by them, you can't do it. I'll go for a different one. Go for this production one over here. You're dead? Act like it. Yeah, the combat definitely needs an overhaul. Bees! Oh, thank you, Mimikyu. Having bees thrown at me always calms me down. Just the, the feel of the, the little bee stings all over me. Just, oh, it's exactly what I needed. Thank you very much, Mimikyu. Whew. Okay, let's try this again. Heal. It's also annoying that you can heal while sprinting, but you can't start healing while sprinting. Sort of, if you start healing and then sprint, you continue healing, but if you, while sprinting, try to heal, you just can't. Hello? Why is my gun green? I see you.
sometimes just two body shots do it, sometimes 15 body shots and they just ignore it. I know they have different like healths and stuff depending on the kind they are and there are like six or seven kinds or whatever. Whatever. Easier way to get in. Fuck the door. Oh, that was close. Whew. Uh, any loot? Production station, nice. Anything up here to steal? Yes. Ooh, a production tier, nice. Ammo. Uh, okay, I don't need that, but I do want the shredder. Mm, that's it. Ah! Cock off. Grenade. Cool. Ah! No, oh, my health is very low. No! I'm fucking closed! And he's in the ground! Sorry, I thought there was another bloody corpse firing its gun, but no, it's the game glitching out. Right. Where was I? Is everything in the ceiling gone? Yes. Uh, right, I don't need the copper bolts. Right, needed that. Okay. Now I get some good stuff. Ooh. Oh yeah. Nice. Hey, can you come pick me up? I don't want to walk all the way back. Yeah, it is in early access, so there is entirely the chance that they're going to fix all of my issues with the game. Apparently they are working on, or they are planning to do a uh, combat overhaul. I think it should be a top priority. Because at the moment the combat is a massive draw against this game. And a massive point against this game, whereas really it should be, it should sort of be the the flowing thing that connects. It's like it's the classic early access blunder of uh, adding new features instead of fixing broken stuff, because adding new features gets more people talking about you. Fixing broken stuff is just a quality of life change. No, that doesn't go in there. But those do. So there is every chance that they will fix it, and I choose to believe that they intend to. <sighs> oh, missed one. There. Okay. Right, whatever, just get on with that. What do I what do I need for this? Excuse me, what do I need for this? Uh, upgrade? No. Production. No. Yeah, like Raft. And that's that's why I'm so reluctant to return to Raft, because it squandered its early access chances with me. It was way too focused on 
the big draws rather than fixing the problems and adding little quality of life features. And that's where uh, Slime Rancher did well, because that made an incredibly polished core game and then added to it. And that is the bloody right way to do it. You make a core gameplay loop that its early access doesn't need to last forever, but is an enjoyable experience all round. And then you can add stuff to it without... Um, uh, you, you can add stuff to, to it without leaving people stranded, basically. Okay, I'm all full of modules now, I think. Yeah, yeah, I am. To, fair, to be fair to the game, it does a better job at being an early access game than Jalopy does being a full release game. No, I don't think it does, because Jalopy had its problems in the full release, but it was definitely playable. Uh, I didn't do the core gameplay of Jalopy and constantly think, this is incredibly infuriating. There were a few moments, but the combat in this is very annoying. Quest finished. Sure, I'll just leave that to keep going. I need a second one, really. I need more research module. There's no module there, is there? There is no module there. I need a research. Give me a second research module. Uh, yeah, I've got this, the power for it. There. I'll make things go quicker. All games should be more like Slime Rancher. It was a really good example. Yep, I'll do my repairs now. It's a really good example of what an early access game can be like. Oof, damn, that took a bit of a beating on that side. Jalopy is a, a, a decent game. The other one that... Uh, the only other driving game that I can really recommend is Wreckfest. I almost played some more of that the other day. And I, I'm not into driving games at all. But still, that was good. Right, I don't actually think I'm going to be able to put this one in. Because I think I'm going to be at my max of core. Let's have a look. Oh, it's just the panel. Mm, yeah, okay. Played Slime Rancher after like 20 episodes of your series and even, even though the graphics were too much for my PC, I had a blast. Hmm. Good. I'm glad. Slime Rancher is one of those early access games that I feel did well. It came out of the, the early access producing a stellar game. And that is, that's too rare these days. Right, let's light this place up a tad. Uh, right, I'm going to have a floor. I'm going to put in an extra floor. Structure, floor, hole. I don't know why there's this one. Because, unless it's just to, to be a roof, but I haven't found a way to actually have... Um, like to connect above ground. What do I need? Copper tubes. Uh, that, and I also need a ladder, please. Oh, no, pick it up. I'm so used to Minecraft where you build something and it's in your inventory. There we go. And a light. And I've got one more light. N nope. Well, let me put it on those ones. Can put one there, though. 
And another one there if I can afford it. Yeah, nice. Nice. Nope, that's not a light hole. No, I assume because I got modules on the roof it won't let me. Okay. Uh, anything here I can move. I can break that down. He said those didn't work. He said those didn't work. I'll just break them all down. I'm still down in there. Can I break these down? Do they need to be in the storage? They probably do, don't they? That and that and that. Cool. Oh, nice. So it gives you a reason to steal stuff. And honestly, who doesn't need a reason to steal stuff? Very nice. Alright, how's the research going? 74%. Is this running at double speed? Should be running at double speed. Why is one... Oh, it's not running at double speed. Because there aren't enough core slots. Because I need an improved core. Damn it! So what can I bring up? What am I not using right now? I'm not currently using the refinery module. So that's reduced the core in use. So I can deploy that and double the research speed. So there, there are like, there were last time I played, and I assume that's what those controller things are supposed to do. They essentially um, uh, allow you to change which modules are up. So like if you're going to do a load of research, you close all the other modules and you just open the research modules. And there we go. And I don't think I'll be able to put this in. I can put this in. What do you want? We will need access to better research equipment to upgrade the drill ship systems to allow production of higher tier materials such as the research module T2. Okay. I... For that I need upgrade basic research. I need research tech which is the one I've not done yet. So that's the brown one. I have three. Is that enough? That is enough. Brilliant. <sighs> so, is this the sort of game you want to see more of? I'll do the vote on uh, Sunday or Monday uh, to choose the game for the next stream. Uh... It, the vote was really close, actually. Gather destroyed modules. Yeah, so I've been doing that. Uh, the vote was really close. It was like 2, 2, 2, and 3. And so this won by one vote over everything else which had, which was just tied for second. Um, yeah. I mean, I, I have thought about streaming Ark Nights because I have, like, I go on that for a couple of hours a day. But at the same time, I basically tab out every time I play it. It sounds so... It makes the game sound bad. And the game... It, it's hard to justify it. The game is... The gameplay isn't sort of stellar or anything, but it's it's got me completely gripped. And I really look forward to going on it, like two, sometimes three times a day for uh, even maybe as much as an hour at a time. If I go on three times a day, it's usually less than an hour each time, but um, <clears throat> but it is I just really enjoy it. I love the aesthetic, and I'm probably going to do a top five Ark Knight operators list at some point. Oh, put that away now. 
That goes there, that goes there. Cool. Why is that stopped? Oh, stop because it's done. Nice, do that now. Ah. So this is like the processing part. Where it can be a little bit sort of grindy like when you're making stuff in Minecraft. But be, I think because there are fewer possible ingredients, you're not like going, oh, okay, I need to go get some of those, and oh, I need a single pane of glass and so on. This, you just have these stations. So as long as you have it in the collective storage, uh, which can hold a hell of a lot, as you can tell, then um, you're golden, really. And that's pretty good. I still see your sing something, Flaffy. I'm desperately trying to get the courage to sing Sweet Dreams, but I just, I don't think it's going to happen today. I'm sorry. It'll stay there until I use it. So, as long as you, you don't mind waiting for it. <laughs> oh, I need to find a village and steal every piece of food they have. Oh, did you guys try Overgrown? I've been unlocking the uh, the other tiers and so on, and apart from the squids, I haven't hit a massive roadblock. Good. I'm glad you like it. Uh, put that in there. Yeah. Uh, are you trying the thing I suggested, where you're sort of living in different buildings and working together? Ooh, two minutes till the next eruption. Learn and practice, then Monday we had a ballad. Is it raining? No, of course not. Why does it sound like it's raining? Do you hear that? I think it's supposed to be wind. Well, no, that's not supposed to be wind. Almost done. Come on. Come on. There it is. Oh, I've got four modified tracks. Can I do anything with that? No, because that is not done in there. That is done elsewhere. Hardened drill. Finally, we can produce first movement upgrade the hardened drill. Once it's constructed, install the upgrade. Produce the first. The same way as the other upgrades. If the production of upgrade of the upgrade takes too long, make sure to open more production modules. Okay. Oh yeah, it was in here, wasn't it? Upgrade, here we are. Uh yeah. Can't do that one yet. I'm actually intending to continue playing after the stream. Good. I'll probably go on it a bit later. Ooh. Ooh, excuse me. I'm almost at the stage of having my first power generation properly. Um, I'm sort of I, well. I'm I've stopped doing that. I'm following the uh, uh, the the quest book at the moment. Just trying to open as many as possible. Because apparently in the next version of the pack, they were planning to set it so that all of the things are open from the start. You don't need to, like, do a special quest in basics to open the other trees. Um, but they changed their mind about that. Well, and sorry. Sorry, I'm not paying attention. Uh, there was never a second version. I don't know why I said they changed their mind. They, they, they didn't do another version. Yeah. I saw it on a forum. In the next version, we plan to... And then it just never happened. But, after this, I, th I have a little break, and then I've got a big special recording, which I can't tell you anything about. Hmm. 
And then I'll... No, I won't be done with work for the night. I still need to do more work after that, but, you know, I'll take a break. So I, I probably will go on... Well, probably Ark Nights, actually. It's been a few hours since I went on Ark Nights. Yeah. I'll probably go on Ark Nights for a bit. Uh, just do, like, two... Surface, quick, before they bloody do. Surface. Oh, you twat. <laughs> they do when they do that. Steal your fucking parking space. Classic... Robot? Hmm. Alright, let's try going down. I haven't shown... Oh, hang on. I saw a pump. I haven't shown you what's down from here. So there's like a layer lower where you can't surface directly. Oh, sorry, you can surface directly, but you surface into the caves. So like here, there's a, a drill. There's already a drill in Devil's Stomach. Let's see if I can find somewhere to surface to show you. Can I go across this? I can, but that... It's not something I want to do. I move too slow right now. So on these lighter patches, you can sh stick a periscope up. So this is what this area is like. Lovely, ain't it? No, that was occupied. Ah, here we are. Devil's stomach. So these are like I think there are three caves: Devil's stomach and two others. And the plot happens down here. Actually, I do need to heal as we're going up. So I won't stick around here. This is a good place to get um, uh, tier two places, tier two things. It's quite pink. Quite pink down here. This is a good place for tier 2 stuff. Because it's a bit it's a bit more sort of secluded. They can't just come from any direction. It's a closed off system. So there'll only be a couple of other locations around. quick snoop before we call it a day. Watch out for the immensely hot lava. Reload, thank you. Oh, there are two of them. Oof. That one I did not. Right, I don't actually have the ammunition to take on a thing. Uh, the underground is... Uh, oh, cock. Yes, the underground is affected by the lava. By the eruption. You, you have to be not surfaced. Even underground surfaced, you know? Am I still being followed? Yes. Off we go. I'm leaving now. Bye bye, guys. Down we go, down we go, down we go. Oof. Christ. Taking a pounding. And there's a quest. You have taken a pounding. Yeah. Bloody called it. Right, where took a pounding? You good? 
And in the back. You not good. Ooh, you very not good. You good, you good, you good. And up here. You good, you good, you good. In the front. You good, you good, you good. You good. And up here. You good, you good, you good. Cool. <sighs> Alright, let's go back to not the underground. Do you remember that song, The Underground? There was a, a song called the. Uh, it was like Underground or London Underground that got inexplicably popular. So these white lines, these show the different cave systems. So this is all the Devil's Stomach or whatever it's called. And that's how you can sort of tell what parts are part of what. Can I see the map? Oh, I can. So that's all the Devil's Stomach, so there are three entrances to that, and then there's the tunnel, so let's head back there. And you can see the things in between. That's the one I was fighting. Yeah, Pyro members. Going underground, going underground. Something, 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 something. Going underground. I don't remember the lyrics. Wasn't there a line about a JCB or was that a different song? On my dad's JCB. Uh, these are parts where you can pass through, but only if you have the particular drill upgrade. From what I can tell, the main driving thing of this is improving your drill. You improve your drill to get to new locations, to improve your drill, to fight better robots, to get better stuff to improve your drill, and so on. Let's have a look at the map here. There's the high pass, the ravine landing, safe grounds, the harbour, Boulder Shores. Can we go to Boulder Shores? Oh, no, never mind. Can we go to Craftsman's site? Yes, it is. Unoccupado. Yup, we go. Drop off the crap I got. It's full because we're underground. Yeah, that's the primary loop. Ooh. Ooh, stretching. Ooh. Ugh. I got some new bedding yesterday. I'm really proud of it because I like it and it's pretty. It's about time I changed my bloody bedding. It's, um,. Uh, Union Jack. It's beautiful Union Jack bedding. Have we surfaced yet? Now we have. Deploy, deploy quicker, please. Wow, look at all those quests. There we go. Cool. Alright, what do I need to do then? Repair damage modules. Sure, why not? Just to get it off my bloody queue. Repair module. That one. Alright. One less thing on my queue. I get your joke, Pi, but I'm just going to ignore it because I prefer to call it the Union Jack. I don't care if it is factually inaccurate. Fa, I say. Fa to you and your... P uh, pe pedanticness, pe pedan ped 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 pedantry, pedantry, that's the word. You and your pedantry. Pe 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 pe. He's making reference to the fact that technically it's the Union flag and it's only called the Union Jack when you're uh, at sea. The British flag, that is. Oh, what do you want? Don't be, don't you dare tell me there's another damage module. Oh, look, there's another damage module. <laughs> 
Can I disable that? I don't want him to bloody tell me to fix it every single fucking time. No, I can't tell him not to. Yay! Urgh. To be honest, most British people don't know about it, so I, I wouldn't worry. Alright, well... I don't really have time to go on another raid. Hardened drill? Oh, I'm missing the hardened drill part. Hmm. Yeah. Alright, what I'm going to do is I'll kit myself out so that as soon as we start the next stream, whenever that is, whether it's next time or not, I'm ready to immediately go out and blow some mothers. What a weird way to put it. <laughs> First time this stream. <laughs> uh, copper tubes, please. Uh, is that all of them? Alright, I want three more if I can. You are out of copper bolts. And you are out of copper. Which means I need to turn the refinery module on by turning the research module off. And copper bolts. Nice. Okay, there we go. So now, next time, we're all ready, and I will just very quickly set that to do like 20 of those. Yeah, this has been a fairly clean stream. So, I'm going to leave it there. If you want to see more of this, do let me know in the comments and I will do another vote on Sunday or Monday to decide what we play next. I'm still still going to be taking a break from Minecraft and maybe from Stardew, I don't know. I just I feel like playing other stuff right now. Um, I'm, I'm not sure. I, I don't know about Stardew. We'll, I'll, I'll decide over the weekend. So thank you very much for watching. I promise I'll do the Sing Something next time, Flaffy has been sat there since the beginning of the stream um, I'll practice sweet dreams and maybe maybe probably not but maybe I'll feel like singing it who knows so thank you very much for watching uh, this was Vulcanoids it's available on Steam uh, it's in early access if you enjoy the look of this go check it out and Deltarune I'll look into Deltarune and see if I can put that on the vote for the next one so thank you very much, and I will catch you later. Say hello to the future. Bye-bye.